Senate Republicans are now likely set to confirm President Trump's new Supreme Court pick less than six weeks before the presidential election. The last hope for Democrats to block the nomination, Utah Republican Mitt Romney confirming that he will support a Senate vote for President Trump's pick. At the top of President Trump's list of potential nominees is Amy Coney Barrett, a devout Catholic backed by religious conservatives and anti-abortion activists. The battle for legendary justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg's vacant seat boiling over as Americans across the country have criticized Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell's move to push through President Trump's nominee after refusing to vet President Obama's pick in 2016. But Republicans say this is a different situation because they now control the White House and the Senate. But do you understand why many Americans view this as a double standard? I can only repeat that uh, we have an obligation under the Constitution should we choose to take advantage of it. Uh, to fill the vacancy, and I assure you that's very likely to happen. Democrats now powerless to stop the vote on President Trump's pick are outraged. Senate Min Minority Leader Chuck Schumer saying if Republicans move forward with the process, quote, they will have stolen two Supreme Court seats four years apart using completely contradictory rash analysis.